Well then, Bunny, it's time once again for us to uncover the truth yes. that has been hiding right under our noses. Because it's hard to look under there because you're because of where your eyes are located. Actually, your eyes see your nose all the time, but because it sees your nose constantly, your brain does this thing where you don't consciously see your nose. Honey, I love you, but you're killing me. Sorry, you're killing me here. Sorry. Well, that's you that is dying. that is very similar to if you spend a prolonged time in a completely white room you'll start seeing bugs. Yeah. Yeah. Because you're in an, because you're in an all white room, you can like see the imperfections in your eyes. So like the cones in your eyes that are not functioning, you'll see them as black spots in the white room. And then your brain will interpret it as bugs. Okay, if, I, if you're talking about the same thing I'm thinking you're talking about, it's not necessarily that your eyes aren't functioning. It's leftover bits in your eyes from when your eyes were developed in the womb. It's, I, I can't, I've already had a glass of wine. I can't word correctly, but like, <laughs> it's basically leftover DNA bits in your eyes. Yeah. That because your eyes, when they were developed, there was like a film left. My, my optometrist explain this all to me um because i was like look I'm, i see these little fucking squiggly lines in my eyes constantly and it gets worse when i'm tired and so he explained it to me and when you're uh, when you're developed in the womb your eyes leave behind this like i guess it's a dna bits yeah and it's it's probably what you see in an all-white room yeah that that okay that makes sense that makes sense to me because it, it looks like and that probably is the same in, thing. in my eyes. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I mean, that's not what I was going to say. That's kind of similar. Oh yeah. You yeah. know, when you, um, when you're in a room with a smell for more than 20 seconds, usually with the acceptance, uh, exception of your coworker, uh, your body decides, okay, I'm used to the smell now and it's not as strong. So when you leave the room for an extended period of time and come back, then it can be an overwhelming smell again. Yes. Yeah. Science with Natasha. There you go. Have yeah. Have you ever noticed that if you're on a web page and you're reading the web page or whatever, the ads that are like kind of in your peripheral vision sometimes they seem to move. Yes, and you don't even think anything of it because shit in ads move. All the time. Until you have to look at it and stare at it and be like, that bitch ain't moving. Yeah. 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 All the time. I have no explanation for that one. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, it happened. Well, that yeah. was a strange tangent. What launched that off? <laughs> right in the middle, right in the middle of an introduction of a new bit. <laughs> like I'm in the middle of a sentence. <laughs> Like right here, like I mentioned the noses, and then you're like, <laughs> noses. <laughs> I've got things. I've got science about noses. Science. Yeah. Well, well, write that down. Noses is a trigger word for Tasha. Yeah. Yeah. I need to learn your trigger words. <laughs> I mean, clearly it triggered her. I mean, yeah. No, he said under your nose because you can't see it. So yeah. I had to explain. No, your eyes can see your nose. Eyes, really, it's <laughs> eyes. Yeah, I gotta watch out with my science around this woman because she's in so many classes. And like, oh no, it, it, I'm later. I'm gonna be talking about how Robin Williams and uh, Joan Cusack have such great chemistry, and then suddenly you hear Natasha running from the other side of the house. Chemistry. <laughs> Did you know nucleic acids? <laughs> we need two chemicals, covalent bonds. <laughs> I hate you both so much right now. Fuck you. So are you saying that we have a covalent bond? Sure. Because we're uh, so close. That's the strongest type of bond, though. I'm uh, fine. So if that's the one you want to go with. 